Hello everyone, this is going to be a reading for Virgo to see why their crush isn't talking to them. Uh, I'm going to be doing love readings towards the end of this week and um, I'm going to look into the situation in more detail and see their feelings towards you and all of that but for the moment right now I'm going to focus on this specific question. Uh, why isn't this person talking to you? Okay, so let's see. Please tell me about Virgo. Virgo right now. Give me four cards for Virgo. Why isn't this person, Virgo's crush, talking to them? Um, I want a card for the situation, the obstacle, the advice, and the, the outcome. So why isn't this person talking to Virgo right now? Give me four cards, the situation, the obstacle, the advice, and the outcome of Virgo. Okay. Um, interesting cards here because... Uh, uh, I, I see you currently having worries about this, which makes sense because they're not talking to you. But interesting, the advice is the Five of Pentacles, which is a card of turning your back and leaving something behind. So I would have thought that the cards are advising you to let go of this man. But look what shows up in your outcome, the Ace of Swords. There is going to be communication between you two. Or at least you're going to get some clarity. You're going to find out the truth about this. So very interesting spread. Let's see. Let's see more. Uh, why is the situation now the nine of swords for Virgo? Please tell me why is the situation the nine of swords for Virgo? Yeah, you're you're worried. You missed the opportunity. Um, you're worried that he has moved on and you missed the opportunity with him. It could be something related to distance. You cannot, it's, it's not meant to be because of distance or to timing and bad circumstances. Uh, it couldn't progress, we couldn't evolve in this relationship because of external circumstances that were against us. Okay, but in any case, you are just uh, worried that you missed out on this opportunity with this guy. And he basically slipped through your fingers. Um, let's see. Why is the obstacle the page of cups here for Virgo? Please tell me, why is the page of cups the obstacle for Virgo? Okay, so this man is definitely holding back from you. Although, that's not who he really is uh, as a person. If you had the impression that this guy is holding back just because he's the kind of guy who is more withdrawn. Um, he's not the kind of guy who would speak up or get what he want, wants. No, he actually is. That's not the reason why. He, this guy is actually a go-getter. But right now, he is holding back towards you. And it has to do with this page of cups, which uh, kind of worries me that uh, he's starting something somewhere else. We'll see in your outcome what you're going to find out. Mm, let's uh, let's look at your advice before so I can get a better impression of uh, this. Why is the five of pentacles the advice for Virgo? Why is the five of pentacles the advice for Virgo? Yeah, you know, if you were thinking about marrying, this guy i i see this man represented here as an air, uh, air sign if uh that's the case if he is indeed an air sign or uh, the, the kind of person who is very rational you know and intellectual 
He likes to read a lot. He likes to find out all the news. He's a very curious person. If that's your guy, uh, your advice is to walk away from him because this is not going to result in a marriage. Okay? And uh, it's very likely that this guy actually is married or is thinking about getting married or his marriage is elsewhere basically not with you okay um if you feel that what i just said the rational guy it doesn't represent your person um then this is another guy and your advice is to move towards this other guy who is coming up because that's who your future spouse is going to be Okay, um, let's see the outcome because that can change things. Let's see, what's the outcome between Virgo and their crush? Why is the Ace of Swords here in the outcome for Virgo and their crush? Okay, Virgo, I'm under the impression that this guy is holding back from you right now, right? Because there's no communication. We already see that. But just so you know, it could be that you are going to get some communication from him. But just so you know, this is pretty much going to be a booty call. I think he's going to offer you a one night stand uh, or, uh, you know, some sex, basically. I see this as regarding sex or just like a night on the town. Let's go have some fun. Let's get some drinks. That sort of um invitation and uh he will eventually want to take you to bed and i think that that this is why your advice was the five of pentacles because if you were looking to get married to this guy it's not going to happen okay and this is why they told you look count your losses and move on if it's marriage what if marriage was what you wanted you're not gonna find it with this guy okay um so yeah uh, as for your outcome you know it's you, it's your decision <laughs> what you're going to want to do but the way i see it here is that he is going to the opportunity and the communication is going to come yeah he will contact you but for a one night stand if that's what you want go for it but i'm just letting you know that it's not going to be anything more committed or romantic than that it's just sex here what i see okay so that was your reading virgo not the most positive one but i i hope it gave you some clarity um you should check out the readings i'm going to do at the end of the week um the love readings because um they might give you some more details and um yeah that was it for today uh and i'll see you in my next videos Bye for now.